Hello everyone, welcome back to Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion HD Renovation. Now, we did finish up the entire mansion, all 1,000 rooms. And I have the DLC, uh, Care... Care Mary? Care Mary Hospital. And Spooky's Dollhouse, which will finish up the story. So I think we're going to do the hospital first, because I've heard it's a very short 30-minute playthrough. And then we'll get into Spooky's Dollhouse in the next episode. Thought I'd play this. Um, not sure about playing Endless Mode. If we do Endless Mode, I might make that a live stream this month. Anyway, let's get started. Mary Hospital. Wait, hold on, frack. Um... Oh, okay, okay, okay. It's dropping me all the way down from room 995. Needed to adjust my mic. There's no rooms on this. It's a very structured... Um... Level, I guess? Bone, show me what you get. Aram, Aram, Mary. Hello. What the hell you got all the way down here? Your I elevator you broke. There were rooms down here. You know, you could give me a little more, um, in-depth, uh, story as to where the fuck I am. I guess that's too hard. Very hospital. There's a very dusty down here. Nice computer system. Watch, watch it running. Is this Buster rock, rock and a Intel Core Duo? Ooh. Video? Da -do 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 -do. TV? Mm, the good old fashioned CRT TVs. For all of you born after 2010, you'll never experience those. And how much fun those TVs are. So when you turn them on, you rub your hand all over it, get rid of the static. Ooh. So that's the safe point, drinking fountains. Watery life. Oh. Man. Okay, none of the sinks can open. Oh, whoa. Shit, somebody started pushing out blood here. It's never a good sign when you're pushing out blood. That's a that's a big you must go to the hospital. Although you're at the hospital when this happened. A man having his period. Out of order. Ugh. You should always flush your toilets. 
clean. Keep it nice. Because nobody likes it when you don't uh, flush the toilet because it's extremely disgusting. Right, so. The welcoming environment is gone. Now just the haunting hospital. Right, nothing here. It's broken. Oh, all right. <clears throat> Dr. Hamada, onycologist. The patient has displayed increased depression after being informed of their terminal disease. Well, I mean, anybody would be very depressed after hearing that they're going to die. A prescribed, I prescribed an antidepressant to regulate this, but was later told that I had to cancel the prescription. I have no memory of canceling the meds, nor can I find any evidence that my orders were tampered with. Interesting. Is something going to happen around this corner? No. Check back on that. Don't bother the doctors. They've got enough blood on their hands. Deal with it yourself. Oh, wonderful. A very, uh, exquisite hospital. Your pain is just a product of your mind, of your broken mind. It's electronically sealed. Joint pain. I can't read the rest. What are the graphic settings? Can I turn them up? Nope. Anyway, we're gonna head down deep into the dark abyss that is the basement of a hospital. Maintenance room locked. Break room. Well, we do need to hit the things in the break room. That's the thing we need to grab. See, I feel like something's gonna definitely, uh... Come out at me now. But I'm not afraid. I'm a brave boy. That's locked. Squeeze past you. Yeah, that doesn't do jack shit. So I probably have to head back upstairs to the electronically sealed room. No. That's right, I gotta head back to the lobby. The lobby is where I can open this door with a key. Broken. Broken uh, things. Ooh, old classic medicine bottles. Or just alcohol bottles in general. Dr. Hamada, oncologist. It seems the other me has been given, giving him large doses of hallucinogens. They have worsened the depression and he is now constantly screaming and expressing terror at seemingly random intervals. I've tried using a Dialysis machine to remove some of the drugs, but it seems futile. What the hell was going on? It's a horrifying baby. Ah, medicine. Hasty. It looks like something goes here. Hmm, okay. So I'm looking for some sort of crest or emblem. Dr. Toshigai? Toshigi? Achi. 
Tachiki. Dr. Tachiki. Hepatologist. I was just informed that the procedure to extract the patient's liver became fatal. I don't know why. Why did he, we take his liver? There were no donation requests and he was showing signs of improvement. The surgical staff told me I personally demanded the liver be removed for a, an emergency transplant. And the worst thing is I found it. I found his liver, his entire liver, just sitting on my desk. What the? It's... Ooh. The woods move something new. Alright, I got the maintenance key. So I assume that's the exit. Looks fake. Ooh. Nurse Tana Tanaka. Ugh. Tana. Here's Tanaka. Report 405. I blacked out today while driving to work. One minute I was driving down the road and then in an instant I was standing outside my car staring down at a dead cat. I must have hit it with my car and felt sorry. The image of the dead cat has constantly unnerved me today. How did I manage to hit it in such a way to make the body completely twist around like that? Well, Tanaka. Seems like everyone's losing their mind and killing people in this hospital. We cannot be having that. Okay, we gotta go down here. It's up toward the maintenance room. Got no jump scares yet. And I feel like when I open this door. Come on. Nope. Very well. Generator wrist power. Ah, everything turned red. How exquisite. Come on, buddy. Ugh. Unsettling. Head back up here. I feel like power's, like, kind of off. Ugh. A skull. This guy was... Was his head dismembered? That's never a good sign. That's broken. Whoa! Hello? No. Get some fucking big hands. Okay, we'll just. I don't like this. You're still there. You're still there. So. You know, things happen. <laughs> Dr. Kanagawa, hematologist. The patient did not recover from the blood loss. I feel like there is a monster inside my head and it's punishing me away. It's pushing me away while it works on something. I woke up in the patient's room standing over him while an arterial catheter was in the patient, letting him just bleed out onto the floor. This was just a massive murder fest. 
Ah, a red chair. I'll take a seat. Patiently waiting for my jump scare. Please don't scare me today. I hate this so much. Alright, done sitting. Anything? Anything here? Nope. Oh, uh, everything seems perfectly ship shape in this room. Ah, yes, good old staticky TVs. Nothing's gonna go wrong. That looks fake. That's locked. What happens if I go through all these rooms again? Uh, surgical staff liver on my desk. Alright, and it looks like something goes there. But I haven't found anything. Kinda sucks. Ah, yes, that sweet, sweet music. I'm assuming I can still go to the restroom. So bloody. Oh. Got a good save here. Double check these rooms. Yeah, I feel like I should go down the stairs again, which I love, especially when it's dark. Head down this hallway. much more often. What have the doctors been doing? Half of the procedures seem completely unnecessary. I knew the doctors and surgeons are above me and probably know many things I don't, but this is getting strange. What are you talking about? Like doctors just ripping livers out of people, constant beheadings. I see nothing wrong with that. I'm gonna go check this room. Thing is, I've checked this checked this room. Okay, so you're walking. <laughs> I were not active before. Oh. There's that growth. It's the morgue. Morgue. I love the morgue. The morgue is quite an exquisite place to be. Especially in a horror game. Ah, there there's the medallion. So someone's gonna kill me now. Or attempt to kill me. Come on out. Come on. I'm ready. I can take this shit any day of the week. Hey, yo. It's off, buddy. <laughs> no, I don't like being rubbed. I don't like being rubbed.
pretty sure I said I don't like being rubbed. So there's bastards moving around now. So I pick up the medallion. Go out this door. And then I gotta book it. Alright, booking it. Nope, I gotta book it this way. Gotcha. Nope, nope. Okay. We go back into the morgue. A nurse Tanaka. Report for our sick something sinister is beating on the wall of my subconscious, beating like a war drumming motion drum motioning me to march down into hell. Oh wonderful. Pick up some acid. Never know when you need a good dose of acid to keep you going. Eh. It feels like we're very much it. Okay, so I did read that paper. Ah, the isolation room. That's locked. That means I gotta go back down this way. The growth is still there. Okay, so I'm gonna have some bastard charging me, possibly. Go this way. I wanna save, just in case I run into that thing again. Oh, hello, Spooky! It's much bigger than I thought it would be. Oh, no shit. It's very interesting. Well, keep going, Recruit, and I'm sure you'll make it out. Maybe. Recruit. You should tell me more about this place. Very curious. Alright, so medallion. I need to find... Which... Office room. That's the stairs. Wait, no. It just... I got turned around. I feel like it's gotta be in this area. You're here somewhere, I know. There you are, hey buddy. Like the worst security guy on the planet. That looks fake. Alright, so it's somewhere in these middle rooms. There we go. Secret passageway! I love going down a secret passageway into possibly my death. Come on, buddy. Ah, some of the intestines. What's that? More intestines. Let's say they're that's those are the kidneys. That's are you screwed up liver?
Hello. Boxes. Uh, that's a little messed up. Is this part open too? I feel like there's a monster down here with me. Ew. Ew, you're a ew. That's one fucked up looking beast. Okay, you like just coming straight out of a wall. Got the isolation ward key. <gasps> Shut the fuck up. Ugh. No. Come on, buddy. You're not taking me. Oh, boy. Ooh. That's freaky. I was just expecting the big baby head. But no, no, it was that thing. Yeah, this takes forever going up the staircase. Listen, I know you're not gonna jump scare me, so keep. Make me go faster, please. Much more appreciative. Isolation ward. Where was the isolation ward? I feel like I know exactly where the isolation ward is. Go through here. Ward the big security guard monster. That's the morgue. Isolation ward. There it is. Ooh, a note. Nurse Tanaka, 407, report. It wasn't me. I swear it wasn't me. It may have been my body and my hands, but I know it, it wasn't me. Tanaka's going crazy. Excuse me. There's Tanaka, 408. I found out how to stop them. You see, they're in my head and can control me for a time. But if I keep push pushing her the radio log machine to doze my head with radiation, then they go away for a while. Oh my goodness. You just throw radiation in your head to make it stop. I, f I feel like you'd be more effective just putting a gun in your head at that point, but you're very intent on living. gonna go this way you still with me Oof. oh that is so messed up that is just really messed up yeah I already went that way this way is okay just uh, let's take it some hits right now go this way nope not really way I need. I'm coming now. 
Oh, this is so fucking annoying. You're probably like right there. La 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 la. I hate not seeing it after a while. Do I have to take right turns? This way, and I should find. Nope, A again. It's like, where is this supposed to be? It's an eyeball. That's so fucked up and freaky. Some cute horror game, this is. Don't get it. What am I supposed to do? Where's oh there it is. Okay, I managed to find the door. I'm so sorry, my little angel. I've tried hating the man that took you from us, but in the end, the only person I can hate is myself. You always like to scare people, especially when they didn't understand something. I was confounded no one understood your costume, but I guess people don't read read Poe anymore. Even with the new Price film, that man clearly overreacted to your fireworks. But we can only blame a PTSD sufferer so much. I have the key. That is so sad. Probably just ended herself. Here's to see if I was followed. Just knowing this game, it will probably toss something at me here before I even reach the exit. Eh. Uh, I'm gonna take a right. Head straight to a safe point. That is so sad. Nurse Tonica went crazy and blasted her head with radiation. But yeah, I think we're out of here now. Nope, we're not out of here yet. Oh, hello. Hey! So this is not the exit you're saying. I would much prefer to be out of this place. You win! Game time, 26 minutes and 32 seconds. That was, that was pretty good. Pretty nice little $2 DLC. I just want to know what monster took over them in that hospital. It might have been the one that was chasing me, but that's besides the point. Anyway, everyone, we're going to check out the final part of the story to Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion in the next episode. 
Anyway, everyone, if you like this video, please give me a like. If you want to see more content like this in the future, please give me a subscribe. Enjoy Horror Month. Every hour on the hour, a video will be released. And have a great day. Goodbye. I'm <laughs> sorry.